I was watching some videos online uh, about the blood over intent, about why not to do it, and the reason that you don't need to do it. And it just amazes me that some of these guys are pushing that you don't have to do it, and you don't have to do anything because you're already awakening on your own. This, see, to me, is very ridiculous. I mean, this is what got us in this mess in the first place. There's shills all over the internet. There's conspiracy researchers all over the world who are just giving you half-truths. David Icke will give you like 30% truth. But he's not going to tell you about getting to the center of the Earth, the center of the flat Earth plane. And uh, so I was watching a couple of videos, and I don't want to mention any names, channel names, because... Uh, you know, that's not important. But these guys are saying that you don't have to do anything, that you're awakening on your own. It's just ridiculous. And their advice is to do nothing. Let me tell you something. If you do nothing, what's going to happen is you're going to die. You're going to live your life. You're going to die. Your soul that's trapped in your heart is going to be eaten up by the Pac-Man soul trap. You're going to be reinserted back into this matrix. Your memory is going to be erased and you're going to be put back here to do this all over again you got to do this while you're alive you got to wake up while you're alive yes you got to wake up while you're alive but you're not doing it on your own believe me if it wasn't for guys like quasi who are um pushing this and pounding it into the internet this uh trip this exodus of going to the flat earth plane the north pole you guys would still be lost you guys might have thoughts about this and that, but you couldn't piece it together the way Quasi does. So uh, my hat's off to him. And uh, these guys pushing to do nothing. Let me tell you something. And to everybody. you got to take your body while you're living with your soul that's in your heart right now. you got to walk to the center of the North Pole. you got to walk there and you got to wake up there. That's how you get out. Otherwise... You're just going to live your life, you're going to die, and you're going to be eaten up by the Pac-Man moon. And be, memory's going to be erased and put back into this matrix. So there's my thoughts on that. Doing nothing is not the answer. That's what got us in this mess in the first place. There's lots of shills out there giving you half-truths. The Bible, the conspiracy writers, David Icke, Alex Jones, all the big ones, they're put there for a, for a reason. So you don't wake up. They know the truth. They know more than they're telling. And the reason we got to flood the internet with this knowledge is that we have to get this above all the BS that's out there. We got to get this into people's heads, into their consciousness, or they won't realize it because there's so much of a uh, uh, false of lies out there. There's so many lies out there that uh and so many distractions out there that we've got to flood it with the with the right information we got to get it to a critical mass where everybody uh understands this and they can then piece it together for themselves that's why the blood over intent is very important so i suggest you write on a piece of paper i intend to bring forth heaven on earth and put your blood on it and search those videos and upload it to YouTube like we're all doing and when there's enough of us we will have an exodus to the North Pole and I suggest you do the sun gazing do it as much as you can it's going to bring you knowledge and do the blood over intent that's what I suggest doing nothing is not an option